Hello gaming world, welcome to Humanity. I haven't played this yet, so we're going to give it a go. Now I don't know what it means by that, but here we go. It says, will you save humanity? You are on a mission to find a new planet for humans to inhabit. The year is 2152. Mother Earth as we know it is doomed. Global warming has decimated her. Humans are nearly extinct. The Earth has become one massive desert with an average temperature of 150 degrees Fahrenheit. Food and water are scarce, but there is hope. Another Earth is out there. And in this uh, story-driven first-person shooter kind of space opera, uh, you will explore uh, world open world planets, find weapons, and uh, upgrade your character, and uh, befriend alien species. And uh, his name is uh, Zip. And with him and my wife with me, we are supposed to repopulate a new world and save civilization. Well, we got a knife. I hear a chicken. Well, with this knife, let's see if we got an inventory. Hmm. I don't see no way to bring up an inventory. All right. I can't grab but one thing at a time. Load and exit game, that's all we got. When I mash F, that's all I get. I'm mashing some other keys just to see if anything pops up. All right, K puts that away. L, eat, can, only eat when health is below 100. Okay. All right, you take that out with number... One and I guess that holsters it. Good morning, and thanks for tuning in to 106.5 WQST. It is January 5th, 2385, and this is your weekly news roundup. 
Today marks the last day to receive the United Government assistance. Good morning, Landon. I hope you slept well. It has been reported that the Would you mind checking on our neighbor Jim? I heard some strange sounds outside last night. Okay, sure, I can do that, Jesse. How is our garden looking? I haven't eaten much in the past few days. Get off your lazy arse and do it yourself. Thanks for tuning in to 106.5 WQST. <laughs> Here is the latest song from artist Soul Symphony. Okay. What should I tell her? Let's tell her that. Don't be a jerk. Fine, I will go check on Jim. How's the garden looking? I need some food. I'm starving. We have a few things growing, but not much will grow in this heat. The temperature was 157 yesterday. I can't believe it. He's, it has only rained a few times this year. But I guess we are lucky that we got away. No one is lucky these days. I heard on the radio that Earth's population is down to 1,200 people. Most oh of them my are gosh. dying from lack of food or from killing each other. I hate to say it, but I think the human race is doomed because of climate change. 1,200 people, I'd think so. I gotta cut off that radio. Try not to think of things like that, Jesse. Let's just... Focus on survival. At least the solar panels are still working. They will keep the lights on and the fridge cold. We have each other and we can survive anything together. That is true. Be sure to take your move. knife when you go check on Jim. The sounds I heard last night were really scary, even for a tough guy like you. I left your knife on the coffee table. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I done got it. Sure thing. I'm gonna hop in the shower. See you in a little while. Love you. <laughs> you smell like rotten pumpkin. <laughs> Turn this thing off. Jeez. Yeah, get away from it. It's the only thing I know. T to save game. Hmm. Hard, I guess it's so we can't kill a chicken. Is this where we're supposed to be going? Howdy, Landon. What brings you down this way? If you are looking for food, I don't have any. Hi, Jim. No, you keep your food. Jessie said she heard something. Sounds out here last night and told me to come check it. I know. I am freaking starving. Nobody has any. You look like you have had plenty to eat. <laughs> I've been hearing some sounds coming from the abandoned house next door. Maybe you should go check it out. Okay, I'll see what it is. Why don't you just keep sitting here doing nothing? 
<laughs> Hopefully it was just a win. I'll let you know what I find out. It would be horrible if something happened to Dolly. Not many kids exist these days. You keep an eye on her. Sure thing, Landon. I am good at that. See you later, then. Yes, you are good at sitting around doing nothing. Keep up the good work. <laughs> oh, I guess that's Dolly. Let me see what's going on here. Well, I done looked in the window, so... Let me pull out my big old knife. Well, can of food, can't eat it till I get hungry. I guess that's an old, that looks like one of them old pizza ovens. Hmm. What in the world? I tried to crouch to look in there, but... That is all I heard. Let me put that back up. Unless something went out through the chimney. Boy, the land is parched, ain't it? Let me tell Jim what I found out. I reckon I can't talk to him a second time. I guess not. Hi, Mr. Landon. Have you ever seen a pumpkin before? Hi, Dolly. I saw a pumpkin when I was about your age. It was huge. It was the biggest vegetable I'd ever seen. I have read about them in my stories. I hope one day I'll get to see one. I bet you will only... I bet you will not only see one, but eat one. They used to make pies out of pumpkins. Maybe your dad will make you a pumpkin pie one day. I really, really hope so. I want to eat 100 pumpkins. <laughs> I'll talk to you later, Mr. Landon. Bye for now, Dolly. Okay. Could be. That ain't no abandoned house. That's just pure... Oh! Whoa! Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. I forgot about that. <laughs> well. We can't get nothing out of it. <laughs> well, 
Well, I'm going to get that food in here off of that counter. Whew! That scared me. That was yummy. Nothing in a bag. I guess not. Jim, did you not see that bear chasing me coming by here? What the hell was that growling sound? <laughs> A bear? I thought bears were extinct. I wonder how it got all the way over here. It must have been someone's pet. Surely all the bears in the wild have starved to death by now. I don't know, but I just killed a bear with my knife. I'm a bad A. You are a badass, Landon. We can eat the bear meat for a month. I'll start cleaning it. Thank God I am starving. I am going to tell my wife the good news. Oh, that's his wife. Well, you better get it quick before it disappears. What well, are they chickens over here? Unless they're using them for the eggs. Let me save that. And it's magic, too. Uh oh. Wait a minute. Is my wife the bear? And she's been trying. Oh, she's now she's taking a shower. Honey, hurry up. Get out of there. Whoa! Y'all close your eyes. Honey! Honey! Uh, y'all keep your back turned while I talk to her. Uh, y'all try not to look. I'm gonna I'm just slightly turn around here. Y'all don't look. Please don't look. This is my wife, y'all. If I could hold the towel up, I would. Please don't look. This is my wife. Oh, y'all don't look. Please. Talk to her. Can I get a little privacy, please? Oh, no, 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 no. You will never guess what happened to me. I killed a bear. I figured out what the noise was. I just killed... I, it was just a bear. I took care of it, Jesse. Jim is fine. What? Bears still exist? Why would you kill it? It could have been the last bear in the world. I had no choice. It attacked me. It was either me or the bear. I feel horrible about it. I would never want to hurt an animal if I did not have to. Oh, I see. That's crazy. I'm glad you're okay. I'm gonna I have, really hope you didn't just kill the last bear in the world. I'm going to have to put a little block out over the uh, privacy area, y'all. I mean, it shows it all, so I'm going to have to block it out. You know, I really am. She says, I see. That's crazy. I'm glad you're okay. I really hope you didn't just kill the last bear. What was it? In the world. It's underneath my camera up there. I can't half see it. This is one of them monitors with that little eighth inch frame around it. At least now we have food for a month. That bear's death will not be for nothing. We will use the meat and the fur to keep us alive. 
Wow, that's wonderful. Would you mind going into the old trailer park and checking on our water supply? Our water smells yucky today. Sure, I can do that. I can do anything. I just killed a bear. Are you sure it's not you who smells of the funk? <laughs> I got to start saying some of this, really, because <laughs> I want to see what her response is. Okay, thanks for doing that. She's lazy. Okay, thanks for doing that. You're welcome. Be back soon. Y'all close your eyes, please. Um, you know, I don't know what's in that uh boy he chokes it down don't he can and all well i am going to walk over here to the trailer park see and what's gonna happen is uh you're going to stumble across a, uh, a wormhole that teleports you uh, light years across the uh, solar system to a planet, strange but beautiful planet, and that's where you meet Zip that uh, helps you with the new world thing. Oh, now the gate looks like it's slightly open a little bit. Let's see. Ah, uh -oh, music's changing. Save. Alrighty. Oh, there's food all around. Oh. A gun. Yes. What does that note say? This is the end. We have run out of time. It is too late to be stopped. Say goodbye to your loved ones. Oh my goodness. Well. Let's see. Okay. I mean, what is this all about? How do I check the water supply over here in the trailer house area? Do I go in these? I don't like this music, it sounds bad. That music's getting worse and worse. This don't look good at all. And they got bats. Uh oh, 
I don't think I can get in any of these. just don't know what's happening here. Shouldn't have to be like this. Is that the water tanks over there? shoot through the fence but yet I see uh, the bullets hitting on the other side over there future problems. I'm figuring there's only... Is that a save? No. Where's the other save at? Can't go through there, can I? Well, dang, this boy's got skills, ain't he? I can almost jump to the stop. I'm gonna save it over there. I'm hoping there's only a certain number of uh, people. leave it here but we'll be back to finish this this will be the cliffhanger but all like share subscribe favorites and comments are welcome 
If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. If you like what you see, please hit that like button. And as always, I love you, appreciate you. If you want to support the channel, there's a place down below that you can do so. All um, donations go toward content for the channel, like this one right here. And uh, it helps the channel to grow. Uh, appreciate you. Bless you, and everybody have a great, fantastic day. Thanks, everybody.